Sheepadoodle vs. Golden Doodle A sheepadoodle and a golden doodle are comparable because they are both doodles. But, did you know that these doodles couldn't be more different? On the one hand, you have a gentle, laid-back personality, and on the other, you have an easy-going goofball that has a love to move and play all day. Today we will be exploring the sheepadoodle vs. golden doodles, and the perfect types of home for each breed. Origins of Sheepadoodle vs. Golden Doodle one way that the sheepadoodle and golden doodle vary is that they have different origins. These origins are great to know in hybrid dogs because it gives us a peek into how they will act and look. A sheepadoodle is a cross between the Old English sheepdog and a poodle. The Old English has a back history in herding and being great farm dogs. But, the sheepadoodle was a breed created by the US military as police dogs, but with their lovable appearance, they soon won our hearts. A Golden Doodle is a hybrid of a Poodle and a Golden Retriever. These were first bred in 1969 as guide dogs, but by the 90s, they were the most common designer dog in America. These hybrids were chosen for guide and therapy dogs because they were low shedding and highly intelligent. While it is not uncommon to see a Sheepadoodle therapy dog, most doodles are bred purely for looks and personality anymore. Temperament of Sheepadoodle vs. Golden Doodle because these two doodles have such different origins, they also have different temperaments. The sheepadoodle is generally very kind and gentle. They make great family dogs and don't require a lot of activity. The sheepadoodle is also very smart and forms close bonds with its owners. But, don't let their calm nature fool you. These doodles love to romp and play just as much as any other dog. The golden doodle is also a lovely dog, but they are a lot more active. They love to be a part of the adventure at all times. And, with this energy comes high intelligence. Golden Doodles are some of the smartest breeds in the world currently. Your Golden Doodle will love to make you happy and will do anything for a little praise. Both of these Doodles love company and do not fare well in households where they are alone for the majority of the day. But that doesn't mean you can't own one. You will just have to invest in great puzzle toys and maybe even doggy daycare. Training of Sheepadoodle vs. Golden Doodle Since both of these dogs are doodles, they have inherited the poodle intelligence. They are both smarter than your average dog, even though the Golden Doodle has a slight lead in this case. These doodles will love to have tasks and genuinely enjoy training times. It satisfies their need for importance and skill to master. They are so proud of themselves when they learn a new trick, and they hope you are too. Daily training throughout your doodle's life is a must to keep them active and entertained. As with all doodles, this intelligence comes with a price. Your doodle will get bored quickly while you are away for a long time. So, it is crucial to keep them active and entertained with puzzles that challenge them. Without this, your doodle will develop bad habits like barking or chewing. Energy Levels of Sheepadoodle vs. Golden Doodle each doodle loves to have an enjoyable romp around and some great playtime. But, some need more than others. For instance, a sheepadoodle is only moderately active. They can thrive well with only about an hour of intense playtime. This playtime can include a brisk walk, playing fetch or tug of war, and other outdoor activities. The larger your sheepadoodle is, the larger yard they will need to. Golden doodles, on the other hand, require a lot more physical activity. They will need larger yards and more one-on-one -on -one time with their owners playing. Your Golden Doodle will love outdoor activities like swimming, hiking, running, playing fetch, and even agility training. This high energy is great for active lifestyles. They will enjoy exploring the outdoors with you. With both of these breeds, it does not matter what size of doodle you get. Smaller doodles have the same energy levels as standard sizes. Size and Lifespan of Sheepadoodle vs. Golden Doodle Speaking of size, did you know most doodles come in multiple sizes? These designer dogs come in almost every size you can think of for any lifestyle needs. Sheepadoodles come in standard, mini, and micro. When you think of a sheepadoodle, you most likely envision a standard. These doodles grow to be anywhere from 45 to 80 pounds. But, they also come in smaller sizes like the mini. Mini sheepadoodles can be hard to predict the size, but generally, only get 40 to 60 pounds. If you want a mini, 
it is best to talk to your breeder and view how big the parents are for a rough estimate. And lastly, the micro sheepadoodle is the hardest to find. A micro only grows to be 17 to 30 pounds, but these are usually only possible by an F1B cross. This cross means that micro will be mostly poodle. Your average sheepadoodle will live 12 to 15 years, even for the larger sizes. Golden doodles also come in three sizes, standard, mini, and toy. Standard sizes grow up to be 50 to 60 pounds, which can be considerably smaller than a sheepadoodle. Mini golden doodles can get anywhere from 35 to 50 pounds. And, a toy golden doodles are also an F1B cross that only gets 20 to 35 pounds. A golden doodle can live anywhere from 10 to 15 years, with the smaller breeds living longer than standards. Coat types of sheepadoodle versus golden doodle. Sheepadoodles usually only have a wavy coat type that is soft and dense, but they can sometimes have a curly coat type. These doodles are hypoallergenic and shed very little. Sheepadoodles come in a variety of colors, including black, black and white, and sometimes red and white. Golden doodles can have straight, wavy, or curly coat types. For a golden doodle to be considered hypoallergenic, it has to have curly or wavy hair. This is because straight coat types shed a lot more. The most common golden doodles will be apricot, cream, and red colors. But, they can also come in chocolate, black, or a variety of colors. Grooming of Sheepadoodle versus Golden Doodle Both the Sheepadoodle and Golden Doodle require the same amount of grooming to keep them looking healthy. You should brush your doodle daily to prevent knots, especially in high friction areas. But unlike some other dog breeds, these doodles will also need to be taken to a professional groomer. Since doodles do not shed, they will need to have their hair trimmed every 6 to 12 weeks to keep their fur manageable. These grooming appointments will need to start as young as possible to get your dog used to groom. Their first grooming appointment should happen around 12 weeks old to get them acclimated. Common Medical Conditions Every doodle breed can be prone to common medical conditions if not bred properly. You can significantly decrease the likelihood of your puppy developing a medical condition with genetic testing and going to a reputable breeder. For instance, a sheepadoodle is prone to getting hip and elbow dysplasia, Addison's, Cushing's, cancer, and skin allergies. If you know the parental history, then you could prevent these genetics from reproducing. Golden doodles can be prone to getting hip dysplasia, skin allergies, eye diseases, and heart disease. Simple DNA tests before breeding could help eradicate these common issues. A reputable would never breed a pair that has tested positive for any disease. Breeders would want their stock to be top-notch, and that is why they would have these records on hand to prove the quality of their pups. A great breeder wants to make their chosen breed stronger and better with each generation, not unhealthy and mutated. Cost of Sheepadoodle versus Golden Doodle The last point to compare is the price of these fantastic doodles. A Sheepadoodle cost can be on the low end of $1,000 to a high end of $3,000. The more expensive sheepadoodles are of rare colors and sizes, and they usually have a longer waiting list than normal. This cost doesn't include all of the necessities for owning a dog like food, toys, grooming, and other various supplies needed. The average golden doodle cost is as low as $1,000 on up to $2,500. Some of the higher golden doodle prices is attributed to rare sizes. But the most expensive golden doodles can also be due to color mutations and coat types. For most first-time dog owners, you will likely be looking at spending over $1,000 in supplies and vet visits. But these doodles are worth every penny in our books. In closing, both of these doodles have amazing attributes for any family. With their contrasting personalities and characteristics, you can find the right one for you. No matter if you think that a sheepadoodle or a golden doodle is the right fit, we know they will love you. These doodles will provide your home with a presence that is incomparable to any other breed of dog. You will enjoy their company and how they bring a new meaning to life. A doodle is just the breed to complete your home. If you like the video then make sure to hit that like button. Also if you want more dog training, guides, information then make sure to subscribe to our channel. Let me know what you think of this video in the comments and thank you for watching. 
and please consider subscribing our channel for more about dog training and dog breeds content every day.